Good morning, everyone. It's your boy Stephen Bonamo here. Welcome to another day of vlogging. Um, yeah, guys, this is the view that I woke up to. Look at this. But today, I'm just gonna try find a place where I can get the haircut. See, my airline is really receding. Plus, my beard is all messed up. Yeah, also my skin. My face looks a bit dehydrated. Ah, uh, yeah, in Cebu, there's been no water and electricity for 10 days since the typhoon hit. Um, people have been, you know, going out and getting water to bath, wash in the morning and in the afternoon. But yeah, Cebu is actually going through a lot right now. So, guys, I'm asking for your prayers. Pray for Cebu. Um, hoping things will get back to normal. Yeah, because, you know, Cebu is. It's like a home to me, a second home away from home. I'm just gonna find a place to do my haircut, get my haircut, fix my beard up. Also find a place for laundry. I've been literally wearing like same shorts and shirt for two days in Cebu because I'm just preserving them. There's no water and electricity to wash. So anyway, yeah guys, just going through the day now. I'm just gonna find a place to get my laundry done and also try to find a place for this one my beard and my face my, my haircut god damn look at this i've only i've only seen those cars in tvs and and movies but yeah, this reminds me of American Gangster, the movie, The American Gangster. Wow, look at the burgers. Shit, Jesus Christ. So they are giving me these options for the, uh, the laundry detergent, right? Powder, right? So which one is the best? It's okay, I'll get this. Popcorn, sir. Sorry? Popcorn. Oh, okay. Fabric uh, conditioner. This one, save card. Just found a place for laundry there. I left my laundry there for only 230 something, 200 plus pesos. So I'm gonna pick up my laundry tomorrow morning. But yeah, for now, we're trying to find a barber shop or I can get my haircut done. If not, we're gonna just gonna head to Mall of Asia. The name of this place is called Newport. This whole place going up to where we live. It's called Newport. It's actually in Pasai, guys. Newport Pasai. Very, very organized, guys. So we didn't come to this part of Newport before. Ah, yes, last night. We, we only came and we stopped at the metro area. And we got some groceries. But for now, we're currently here. There's actually some Korean, unlimited Korean barbecue up there. There's actually a lot of restaurants around here. Um, actually restaurants and hotels there's actually a lot of them here and there's also American brands restaurant also New York New York and New York style pizza SNR Andre is at the back and they say hi <laughs> but yeah guys uh so we actually were looking for a place to get get an haircut up there but i wasn't able to find one so andrea also has something to do in mall of Asia, so i was like okay let's just go there i'll go find a barber shop there to get my haircut Guys, we just arrived here in Mall of Asia. This is Mall of Asia. There's a lot of people now compared to last year I was here because last year that was during the peak of the pandemic. So I got the cake from Goldilocks. This is the cake. Mm. And Subuana we said, let me kayo. I'm 
actually trying to find a barbershop and he's actually trying to find a place where she can go to but we can't really find a hello <laughs> we can't really find it because this mall is really huge damn those christmas decorations and the things are still here I just got my haircut here, look. I feel human again, thanks to Koya here. <laughs> okay, okay, thank you Koya. They actually charged me $6.50. And after the haircut was done, I went to the counter and the lady said $6.50, so no choice, I had to just pay. But in my mind, I was like, God damn. This type of haircut, I only get it for like less than 100 pesos in Cebu. But here, it's $6.50 in Manila. This mall right here has the biggest, the biggest cyber zone unit here in the Philippines. I guess, I guess that's the biggest because I've been to malls in Cebu, I've been to SM malls in Cebu, but they are not the cyber zone mall in the malls in Cebu. Are not nothing compared to the cyber zone here. Actually, a lot of people right now here. Look at the back. Andy, Andrea, so we go inside. No. Places is crowded, and we might get on my front. So let's go home. Yeah. I don't. I don't really care about this stuff, but Andrea is. Andrea is the one who's always cautious. <laughs> Whenever also when we want to host something, Andrea will be like, bro, make sure we go to a place where there's no a lot of people. There's not a lot of people. So yeah, right now she saw a lot of people here, so she was like, bro, let's let's just go back home. <laughs> there's coronavirus going around, the new variant Omicron. So yeah, we're not going in there, so just to give you guys a glimpse of this place, that's the back. There are some bars here. Music going on right now. Also, there's people lining up just to have chance to go inside. I think they're limiting the number of people inside the boulevard. So like they're putting their uh, barriers over there, and people are actually standing on the line just to get inside. So.